Hello you wonderful people, I hope you all are doing absolutely great. Welcome back to yet another video. I know I haven't been uploading videos lately. A lot of things were going on. I was out of town and a lot of things going on. So sorry for that. But from now on, every alternate days, you can expect one video coming in on this channel. In today's video, we will be discussing top five biomedical courses, which you can do online. We will be seeing the paid courses and we'll also be seeing the free courses that you can do as a biomedical engineering student or a working professional. So without further ado, let's dive into the video and let's see in detail about these five courses which I'm going to discuss with you all. Okay, I believe you guys can see the screen. So I will take you all through all the five courses one by one. Most of them are free, but one or two courses would be paid. But trust me, it's worth doing these courses as well. So starting off with the first course that I want to recommend you is by MIT Open Courseware, which is Introduction to Bioengineering. So it is a one full course. If you are someone who is new to biomedical engineering or bioengineering and you want to revise core concepts like biomechanics, cell biology, biomaterials, and it's a wonderful course it also includes a lot of assignments notes and lectures as well so um, a wonderful course there are multiple professors who will be taking this course for you guys and uh, you can always download this course the best part is it's absolutely free so if you guys can see on the right bottom corner i will uh, zoom in because of my camera you guys will not be able to see it so if you see right bottom corner i'm hovering my cursor around it so you can download the course completely free and you can go ahead and study from this so this is the first course introduction to bioengineering by mit open courseware moving to the second course i have for you all which is introduction to biomedical imaging right so again a wonderful course it is by edx by university of queensland so a 12 weeks course and you can maybe dedicate four to five hours per week for this course An amazing course you will be learning a lot about medical imaging you will be learning about x-rays ct scans mri scans how this uh, these this these machines actually work the core principles behind this so you can read the description and uh, it's a very uh, interactive course you will not feel bored so what you will learn if you can see you will learn different imaging modalities basic principles of each modality and what are the different terminologies that are used patient experience why th what things happen during an image processing or an image imaging procedure how to select the most suitable modality for a given clinical case so based on different uh, patients a situation based on different clinical cases the uh, procedures are different the imaging proce procedures are different so you will get to know about how uh, to select the most suitable modality and you will also learn about providing basic advice on imaging modalities to your peer so an amazing course sorry for that i'm getting a notification here i'm so sorry for that so yeah this this course is going to be a paid course you can always take this up free of cost if you want to just learn but if you want to get a verified certificate from university of queensland then you can just pay the given amount and you can seek for some scholarship as well so you can just click on here you can see how if financial aid is available and you can maybe try getting some discount for this as well so instructors are again really well experienced working professionals few of them are research associates like research scientists so multiple instructors amazing course to take up good for someone who is in second year third year or final year of the college also suitable for working professional if you want to study about biomedical imaging and you can go ahead and take up this course amazing course so the second course that i wanted to recommend you all is uh, introduction to biomedical imaging by university of queensland it's a really amazing course but if you want to get verified then in that case you will have to pay a certain amount and get the certificate from the university the third course i want to suggest to you guys is uh, iso 3485 2016 a design and development of biomedical devices this course is available in udemy 
why this course is important you will understand and you will learn about iso so iso when you when you design different medical equipments or you develop different implants or medical devices there are a lot of medical standards that you have to uh, abide to right so this course will give you an understanding about uh, medical device industry uh, an overview about medical device industry you will learn about iso 3485 and uh, what is basically the design and development of a medical device what are the steps of design and development of a medical device how to manage the design and development in a life cycle of medical device so an amazing course right uh, you will see the subtopics here there are around 17 lectures and the course is just one and half like one hour 40 minutes long so you can always take up this course and you can do it on your own pace and it will take you just uh, a week if you are maybe slogging really slow it will take you a week to finish it amazing course uh, i would highly recommend you to go ahead and take this course up because if you are someone who wants to get into regulatory and affairs those kind of roles then maybe this is the course which uh, is highly recommended for you now this is a course which you will not get in your college because this is something which they they teach in college is not that they don't teach they teach in college but people uh, rarely pay attention to these kind of courses so i will highly recommend you all to take up this course if you want to know and understand how a medical device is designed developed and then deployed into the market so that is the third course which is uh, iso 31348 uh, in udemy the fourth course is data science for biomedical engineers and the name is a little different it is health data science foundation so this is this course is basically all about a uh, deep learning for healthcare specialization so if you can see the outcomes of this course basically you will learn new concepts from industry experts relevant uh, with respect to deep learning in healthcare you will gain a foundational understanding of a subject or a tool so there are different deep learning tools and there are different specializations or subtopics that you will have and you can select one and get specialization on that specific subject or tool right so you will understand uh, you, you will basically develop job relevant skills with hands-on projects because when you are finishing your college it is very important for you to have a good amount of projects which will stand out from other students in your class so these hands-on projects will help you make uh, your resume stand out from others you will earn a good certificate so uh, i'll tell you guys so there is there is a this is a four week course right four week course you can take up this course free of cost i will quickly tell you how to go about it so you just have to click on enroll for free uh, you can just sign up with your google account so let's go ahead and do that uh, okay so i'm just telling you guys how to avail this course free of cost so if you see if you click on enroll for free uh, give me a second if you click on enroll for free it will ask you for different emi options and uh, amount but uh, a, a hack that i use for this is uh, basically there is something called financial aid click on that and uh, you can select the selected course is health data science foundation by university of illinois you can continue the application and uh, yeah so you have basically a couple of questions you fill that i have reviewed my information uh, students uh, select currency the currency let's put anything that we can click on next again couple of questions let's say one dollar i'm committing to finishing this course please agree to the terms above okay i'm writing my name okay we just have to write this i'm sorry for that so you copy you paste i'm not a bot how will okay basically you have to fill this all these questions and you have to click on review so once you click on review what eventually happens is that after 15 days you will get an email which will say that this course is completely free of cost meanwhile during the 15 days it's a four week course you can finish the course and as soon as the email comes in you can attain the certificate free of cost so if you want a detailed video on this with the relevant answers that you can put in feel free to drop it in the comment section and i will be more than happy to help you out so that's uh, the fourth course i wanted to share with you all which is data science for biomedical engineers by university of illinois in coursera the fifth and the final course is my favorite and all-time best and amazing course which is 
by W. Mark Salzman. So there is an amazing biomedical engineering handbook which is uh, bridging, uh, bridging healthcare and medicine by and uh, uh, Mark Salzman. So you can go ahead and take up this course. It is a uh, Yale University course which is available in their open source platform which is open yale courses so you can so this is a course which will start from scratch if you don't know anything about biomedical engineering you can start from scratch and you can go ahead into a more uh, advanced level so if you can read the description it basically involves a lot of things about basic concepts of biomedical engineering their connections with the human activity so this course will help you understand the biomedical engineering principles how is it linked with a human body right or the human activities you could say and uh, yeah so if you basically what is biomedical engineering using biomedical principles to solve medical problems so this course actually helps you to do that and an amazing course it's going to be a little extended course it is not a short course you will have 30% uh, of midterm 30% of final 30% of research paper and 10% of homework so basically eventually towards the end of this course you will be actually publishing a paper and the midterm will consist of a lot of assignments weekly assignments and things like that amazing course to be uh, to do so I will highly recommend you. So see, if you can see the course structure, what is biomedical engineering, uh, genetic engineering, cell engineering, biomolecular engineering. So there are different lectures and as you go in deep, you will learn about bioimaging, tissue engineering, biomedical engineers and cancer, biomedical engineers and artificial organs. So an amazing course to do. I highly recommend you all to take up and do this course. It is absolutely worth doing so these are the five courses which i highly recommend you all to do uh, there are two so that's about it and uh, these are the five courses which i wanted to share with you all make sure that you are doing these courses if you have any questions queries or any video recommendations put it in the comment section if you like this video please press the like button share it with your college friends colleagues and working professionals and uh, yeah that's about it i'll see you in the next video and we will be discussing about masters doing masters in uh, us or in uk or in any of the countries abroad or outside india so next video will be on that make sure you are clicking uh, the subscribe button and also keeping the notifications on so that as soon as i'm uploading a new video you get notified and you can get the best out of it see you in the next until stay safe stay home and let's learn and grow together signing off it's your environment bro see you in the next bye bye